We have a pretty amazing young man this morning that has come to talk to us and to perform for us. 15-year-old um, Emmanuel Bishop is a self-advocate. Um, and if you turn in your notebooks uh, right before tab one and go to your left two pages, you'll see a little bit about Emmanuel. And because it is so well written, I'm going to read most of what he says here for you guys. Um, he was six years old when he read a welcoming statement in three languages at the National Down Syndrome Society Conference in St. Louis. And at age 12, he spoke at the 10th World Down Syndrome Congress in Ireland and played a violin recital in front of 900 people at the plenary session. That's pretty amazing. Um, and he is going to be playing for us this morning. Um, and he will also be back with um, an orchestra from the, a local Suzuki school, and they will play while you're getting your lunches and before our lunch keynote. So you don't want to miss that. It's going to be great. Um, he is also a swimmer, and he has set six junior Down syndrome world records in freestyle, and you can see them listed here. He's a traveler and has been to Canada, Mexico, Honduras, Ireland, and France. He's a violinist and started playing when he was six, and he is a golfer and started playing when he was eight. He is a polygon. How many of you know what that is? <laughs> he can speak several languages, including English, Spanish, French, and he studies Latin. And I just spoke with him because being a lawyer, I know a little bit he knows a lot more than I do. Um, he's homeschooled and he learned to sight read when he was two years old. He's a cyclist and he is a Catholic. And he was made his first communion at 10 and was installed as an altar server at 13, confirmed at 14. He is valuable because he exists, not because of what he does or what he has done. He is not a burden to society. His life is worth living with respect and dignity. He is a self-advocate so that others may understand he is a person. Please welcome Emmanuel. Je m'appelle 
Amen. Amen. 